Has Luke Skywalker's role for episode nine been revealed? Well, there's some new evidence that we have to break down. This is the Nerdy News Rundown. Let's get you filled in. Maybe the reason Luke was so grumpy in The Last Jedi is because he didn't have any coffee. All right, so let's get right into the news. Mark Hamill has been confirmed to join Nightfall Season 2. Nightfall is a show on the History Channel talking all about Knights of the Crusade and things that happen after that. Mark Hamill is said to play the role of Talos, who is described as a battle-hardened Knight of the Crusades that has been a prisoner of war for over 10 years. This character gets out of exile and is said to train new knights of the order. Sounds kind of a lot like Luke Skywalker, honestly. And while all that seems pretty cool and I'm excited to see Mark throw around an actual sword, the real question for Star Wars fans is what does this mean for episode nine? The hair trigger reaction that a lot of fans are having to this news is that it means we're getting minimal Mark Hamill in the next episode of the Star Wars saga. And not a lot of people are super pumped about that. I wanna stop and give credit to Star Wars Newsnet who did a very nice breakdown of all of this, I want to echo the statement that they had in that article to Star Wars fans, which is basically don't panic. Having said that, let's break down a lot of the information out there and speculate about what it could mean. Now, number one, I do think this means we're not getting Mark Hamill back as Luke Skywalker in the flesh, and he's not going to be in all of the acts of the movie. And honestly, I, I don't think that's a revelation. I, I find it kind of weird that so many people out there think we're just going to get Luke back completely alive and that this film will focus on Luke more than the characters that were set up in episode 7 and episode 8. That doesn't make any sense. Now I still believe that Mark Hamill is going to play a pretty big role in episode 9 but I would venture to guess that's going to take place towards the third act of the film. I think he's probably going to come back in force ghost form, perhaps have a conversation with Leia, with Rey, with Kylo Ren. I think that the scene is going to be significant and important for Star Wars but I do not think it's going to be overly long, and I don't think we're going to get a lot of Luke Skywalker in Episode 9. Now, Hamill himself is currently residing in Prague, which a lot of Nightfall Season 1 was shot there, so a lot of people are thinking, well, he's there to shoot this second season of Nightfall, and that is the majority of the reason why he is there. However, some of his tweets have been talking about this tour that he is on and how he's going to be traveling a lot, and so a lot of people are saying, well, it's only two hours away from London and even though he hasn't ventured to the set of episode 9 yet him being in Prague suggests that Lucasfilm knew about this filming that he would be doing and they wanted to make it as convenient as possible for Mark Hamill to be able to get to the London set. This is a very common thing with actors they schedule things like this kind of congruently so that they can basically chunk all of their work together and not have to be traveling all the way around the world. J.J. Abrams has spoken in several interviews about how important Luke Skywalker is to ending the Skywalker saga, how he regretted not being able to work more with Mark Hamill in episode seven. And so I think when you just look at all of the context that is out there, I believe Mark Hamill will still play a pretty significant role in episode nine, but I do believe that him filming this second season of Nightfall is a hint that we are not gonna get a ton of Luke Skywalker in episode nine. And so that is the news out there. We definitely want to know what people think about this. In fact, we put up a poll on the community tab here on YouTube and a poll on Facebook asking people to tell us how much screen time they want Luke Skywalker to have in episode nine. And while we're on the topic of polls, yesterday's poll really surprised me. We had over 600 votes here on YouTube and it was pretty evenly split on whether or not people want episode nine to be split up into two parts. As of the last time I checked, 55% of people voting said they did not want episode 9 to be split up into two parts, with 45% saying yes, they do want it to be a two-parter. It was a little bit steeper on Facebook. A lot more people said no on that poll, but I was incredibly surprised that that many of you actually do want episode 9 to be split up into two parts. I mean, it's pretty cool to see what you guys are all thinking, and I think Everyone's opinion is valid. So check out the polls we put up today and I will go over them in tomorrow's show. That is going to do it for the Tuesday edition of the show. Like and share and do all of those great things. Man, 
You're making it through the week. We're going to get through this together. As I always say, I hope you are having an awesome and nerdy day, and I will see you in the next video.